Yo, what's up, gamers? D, the new patch finally got announced. Please, bro. Please. <laughs> Please, patch, save us. Oh, man. I'm so excited. It's June 11th is when the patch actually drops, but we'll know exactly what's happening on June 10th. Uh, we have a little bit of stuff down here. Property behavior adjustments for specific characters and moves. New items, additions, second shop, feature improvements, whatever. We only care about this. And I'm going to go over some things that I would like for them to change with Asasina in this next patch coming up next week. So literally as I was about to upload the video, which was going to be very different, uh, I found out they actually did tell us in quite some detail what's happening with this patch. Uh, and patch 1.5 will address issues that are often brought up by our players. Some characters aren't able to fully showcase their unique strengths in Tekken 8. Ca characters like Kazuya, Paul, and Raven will be buffed uh, to make them more relevant. By the way, this says like Kazuya. This means three of them. These are three they're naming. There's going to probably be more. But the big thing for us... Additionally, some nerfs from the previous patches will be readjusted to broaden the scope of gameplay. That means while running 3-2, hopefully, and it also hopefully means 2-1, maybe 1-1, one, one, all these things that needed to go back to the way they were. They overkilled our character, and I think that the data showed it, and so they're putting her back to where she was. <laughs> and that's my hope, my copium, you know? Um, also, some other very important things happening this patch, though. Uh, some moves and combos are disproportionately strong. In addition to character uh, moves adjustment, heat dashes, throws, and stage gimmicks will see their damage scaling recalibrated, a.k.a. they're going to be nerfed. Um, this is done to prevent situations where combo damage can be excessively high. Aggressiveness is a bit too rewarding. Yes, it is, making it hard to defend yourself effectively. Wall staggers from heat dashes will be removed. Remember those things where you're, like, minus 20 after someone does a heat dash against you at the wall? That is huge that that's gone. And the damage of heat bursts and throws are also going to be nerfed across the board. That's crazy good. This is done to increase the importance of sidestepping in three-dimensional plays. Thank you. That is awesome. That is great news. While stiffness balance adjustments were made in patch 104 uh, and will be made in patch 1.05, similar large-scale adjustments will not happen during the remainder of season 1. Patch from July on will focus on fixing the unintended move behaviors and bug fixing. Wow. So... Once again, the big things for me, obviously, some nerves from previous patches will be readjusted. Because, <laughs> bruh, plus two from wall running 3-2, if this doesn't mean that, oh man, oh man. 2-1 would be great uh, to go back to how it was. 1-1 one, one would be great if they fix that as well. Uh, that would make me really, I know that Asasina's win rate has plummeted. Absolutely hit the floor. Uh, after these nerfs because they just overdid it. They overkilled her. Uh, and I'm hoping that they saw that, they noticed it, and they're like, okay, hopefully, <laughs> hopefully we get that back. And like I said, also, this is just good news all around for me. Wall staggers were incredibly annoying. To be minus 20 at the wall where you can't even rage art uh, after someone does a heat dash, is it was too much. Um... And I think that heat burst also getting nerfed is a great idea. And also throws getting nerfed. Um, I wonder how they're going to do that. Is it just going to be less damage for throws? Are you actually going to be able to sidestep? The reason I think you might be able to sidestep is they say this is done to increase the importance of sidestepping in three-dimensional plays. Throws going to be sidesteppable? Is that what's happening? That'd be sick. <laughs> I really cannot wait for this patch. And it could not come at a better time. Uh, because I'm going to be heading out to DreamHack Sweden literally the weekend after this patch drops and if Asasina is back to her former glory or at least you know at least a shadow of it we might be honest something gamers anyway that's all i wanted to talk about um today i'll see you guys in the next one later Bye bye